Hello everybody and welcome back to my Let's Play in Mountain Blade Warband. Uh, so I went to my feast. It looks like more people are showing up or running away. Uh, so I found out that the king and a couple other lords that were at the feast are voting me as the marshal. Which I'm pretty happy about. I talked I went to the tavern, talked to the traveler, and the rest of my companions are being held in Esmeralda Castle. But I've been thinking since I'm Marshal and I just lost Tilba, I'm gonna go after Kara if possible. I'm gonna take everybody to Kara and butcher them. But I just noticed this, uh, and somewhat healed. I got my cavalry troops. We're gonna run in and have good old-fashioned brawl. Two ninety-eight versus four twenty-eight. Not nothing to worry about. I'm just glad I still have my doctor. And I'm gonna fight this, and I'll see you in a bit. And that battle took a very long time. I had forty-four casualties. That's pretty severe. Uh, he had fifty-three. The king, and they had one hundred and forty-five. So, I'm going to go for round two, and I'll see you after this battle. Alright, so that was round two. I had 16 casualties, king at 32, and they had 137. And looks like round three is about to begin. And so that was round three. Uh, 28 more casualties, king at 60, and they had 137. And I'm too crippled to do anything. I'm going to leave. <laughs> that's it's pretty mean, but uh, look at this. I, I was completely uh, completely crippled there. So I'm going to get my sweaty and footman. I'm going to rest up a bit and then run back out there. Uh, before I do that, I might as well level up. So you can see where I'm at. So I'm working on my strength. And I have three points. Uh, at level 21, I'll be able to use three of them. So I'm going to have an extra point. And I'm not sure what to use it on. Uh, I'll go ahead and put it in one point in first aid and crossbow. Alright, so I'll see you in a bit. So, like I thought, uh, King Ragnar has decided to make me the marshal. So I'm going to accept this honor. Uh, troops are pretty healed. Pretty good. So, I need to figure out what to do. I was going to go after Kara. So I'm going to assemble my troops. And I'll see you in a minute. Alright, so I've gathered my troops. Uh, this is the best castle force I have. It's very sad. I probably have a couple of veteran crossbowmen, but trained or good enough. And, yeah, these are my top-of-the-line Nord troops. It's, it's pitiful. But anyway, I am going to start a campaign. As Marshal, I'm going to send a message to the, the Lords of the Realm. Start a new campaign. I ended my feast, gained 20 renown. So I guess being martial automatically ends a feast. I, I have plenty of lords that like me, so I'm going to wait here, see who shows up, and then we're going after Kara. And just by looking at this, there are a lot of Vager troops here. Um, Vager marksmen are pretty devastating. And I didn't grab enough, as many forces as I'd like, so... Uh, what do I have? Well, it's hard to see there. So I'm going to go check out Halmar. Looks like 100, 250, so we have 350 troops. And Halmar's over here, so I'm going to see about taking Halmar. 
So here we are outside Halmar. They have strictly Karjit troops, so uh, taking it shouldn't be too bad. I'll take it. Don't really care. And we're going to besiege this town. 350 Karjit troops against 350 Nord troops. And somebody else just joined. Is no contest. We got this. As long as they don't run off. So I want to keep my archers here. Uh, keep my medic in the back. Actually, let's move the archers up to here. And I have no doubt in my mind that we have this town. I'm getting quite a few headshots, that's what I like. So I think I'm going to go ahead and skip to the end. This battle is definitely over. So I just realized the mistake I made. Uh, we have too many archer troops, and so by telling them all to stay at the bottom of the ladder, I'm not getting any melee reinforcements. So I'm going to be forced to retreat and then attack again, which I don't like doing, but it's something that needs to be done. So here were the casualties. I lost 22, we lost 111, they lost 108. I wish I could have upgraded my troops. But lead soldiers in the assault. So my doctor to stay back and I'm just going to let everybody run up there. That really messed up my assault when I, I, because each time reinforcements came, some of them were archers, and so I had less and less melee troops coming in, coming in as reinforcements. But we'll see how this goes, and I'll I'll come back to you. So I was forced to retreat. Um, we were getting slaughtered, and now all my troops are injured myself included, but there's only 115 left. And these guys are really badly hurt too, so we're gonna we're gonna leave. Hopefully everybody sticks with me. I'm gonna go restock my troops and I'm gonna end up taking that town by myself or not. And this is really disappointing. Right when I got my troops, uh, Nords and Kargets made peace. So now uh, I go after Tilba again. Looks like it's already under siege. Who's who's doing it? Swadia. So I'm not getting that castle back. So I'm gonna go. Wow, Kurgis, they're they're moving up in the world. I want to pick something close to Raven against the Vagars. So that's Sizzlek or Ismerala. Let's go to Ismerala because hopefully my companions are still there. And my companions are still here. There's about 200 troops and the king decided to join me. So we have a pretty good group. Uh, my troops are not good, but we're going to take this castle and I'm going to get my people back. So I have a lot of people with me. Let's start this assault. Doctor, get out of my way. Doctor, back here.
And these Vega Marksmen, they're, they hurt when they hit. I didn't see how many troops I have, but with the king, the king had about 150. And there are probably two or 300 at least. Well, I have 100, so we have at least 400 troops against the 200 here. We need to get these marksmen out of the picture. We're just setting ducks on the ladder. So I'll come back to you guys in a little bit. And I got knocked down, but we've taken out all their melee troops. And there's a lot of marksmen down here. See, these guys know how to shoot. If my crossbowman knew how to do that at Silva, things would have worked out differently. But now we're just coming down here, and evidently our troops are not as good at melee as I would have hoped. It's like a lot are getting knocked down, but they're taking me with them. And I don't believe I have any more reinforcements coming. I might be forced to do a retreat and then reattack. And they have more reinforcements. I'm not being a very good marshal. Okay, yeah, so the only troop left is my doctor way over here. So I'm going to retreat, we're going to reattack, and hopefully things work out better. So I retreated, uh, we lost quite a bit of men, and, but we've taken them down to 90. I really need my companions back and I'd like another castle, so we're going to do this again. Nine hours. No, don't run away. What's going on? <laughs> oh no. <laughs> so he's letting me go. Alright, so I'm forced to retreat. Uh, so I'm going to run back to Raven Inn, I suppose. I'll see you in a bit. And the Nords and the Vegas have just made peace, so I believe it's peace throughout the kingdom. Yeah. So I need to work on my melee troops. I need to recruit a bunch. I need to try to find my companions. Uh, this looks like a good place to call this episode. Uh, I think things are going to look better in the next couple of episodes. I, I learned a valuable lesson from losing Tilbaugh Castle that I neglected in my garrison. So thank you for watching and I'll see you next episode.